Hi guys, and today I'm going to be talking about how NASCAR's rules are a disappointment for the sport. So first of all, we have Talladega, where whole field wiped out, but they were not that damaged. They could still race, but the thing is, is that they had flat tires, and NASCAR's like, oh, they can't get back to their pit stall. That's only if you have a lot of damage and they can't get to their pit stall for like on their own control. But the thing is, is that they were choosing, oh, this guy goes, that guy goes, this guy goes. They only let two cars go and they were like the most damaged cars. So Cindric, my driver, got out. I'm fine with that. <laughs> I like Belmore. But then that happens bunch of playoff drivers they got they, it was ended from Talladega but the second thing is that Alex Bowman is staying at Charlotte where his weight requirements didn't like he was underweight I, I'm fine with that I don't care if he gets out from that but the thing is is that if you look at when he like did that big hop a part came off of his car and later they called out a caution for debris and they were like oh it's from him but then after the race they call him underweight but they know why it's because the part fell off but that's not the thing that's making me mad it's the thing that he like all these other guys have parts flying off like from underneath after a wreck and then they race they don't get disqualified so why is he getting disqualified so then Logano makes it well I'm sorry if I spoil it click off Logano makes it to the next round and then after that he makes it to the next round for he can make it to the championship four because he just won and that's kind of upsetting as a Bell fan because that should be a Bell win and even if I wasn't a Bell fan, that rule needs to change. Like, Bell or Logano was so far below in points that he shouldn't make it all the way up to the next round. So then that makes him go to the championship four. And then if he wins the championship, the whole season of watch, like, I mean, if you're, if you're not a Logano fan, I'm not, but the whole season you watched NASCAR for is pointless because, well, it's not pointless. You enjoy it, but like you want your driver to win the championship. So after that, the whole thing is pointless and yeah. So that's why NASCAR's rules are very upsetting because he should not be in the playoffs. That's, it's all because of NASCAR's rules, but, and then Cindric got out and then all these other drivers got out from that big Talladega wreck and then stupid NASCAR's rule. Like why can't it just be like back then they get towed to their pit stall, and then they have, like, ten minutes to fix it, and they, like, I think that's was the time before, like, a couple seasons ago. And if they can't fix it, they go behind in the garage. They don't do that anymore. They do that, they just choose who gets to fi get fixed in that certain amount of time, like, repair their cars. They only choose who goes and who doesn't. Why can it not be everyone? What's the point? Like, why are you choosing this guy goes, that guy doesn't? What's the point? You see what I mean? Like, give them a chance to repair. And then they choose the two guys out of a bunch of cars that are the most wrecked. And they don't even get back into the race. When a lot of these other guys could have got back into the race. And a lot of playoff drivers. 
that's the thing that upsets me. They gotta change it. I mean, I, I liked NASCAR back then. Like, ever since, like, after, like, 2020 or maybe even possibly 2019. I watched it since 2019. The rules were pretty good. There was still some things that were like, eh, I don't know why that's there. But it's not like that. Also, the caution laps, it doesn't bother me. But my dad's wondering, like, why do the caution laps count? <laughs> it's not like you're, like, you're doing laps around the track. But it's not like you're doing racing laps. I don't know. It might just be for it's like because it's actually because it's laps still around the track. I don't know. But some of these rules they have to fix. Those two rules that I mainly talked about, the damage vehicle policy and then that thing with Alex Bowman, like a bunch of cars have been underweight because a part came off after a wreck. And then they just still make it. But then Bowman... Like, I don't care about Bowman, really. I'm not a fan of him. But... Um... I don't hate him. And I don't like him, but... I mean, I guess I kind of like him, but it doesn't matter. Why does he... Not make it... But then other guys do. I know it's just hitting the curb, but hitting the curb is still like, like that high up. That's still kind of a little incident. Like I know you're on the car curbs all day, but like, come on. If you guys feel me, you guys feel me, and you understand. But especially if you are one of the drivers, like. If Logano wins the championship, that's going to be so devastating, especially as a Bell fan, when Bell should have won the championship twice. His first one he was in, he was leading a lot of laps. Oh, my finger got stunk. Uh, crew chief's finger, or not crew chief's. One of the, the Jackman. My finger got stuck under the car. Now he has to wait in pit road on the last pit stop for 30 more seconds. Next one. Uh, ah, rotor brakes. You feel me, guys? I feel myself. It makes me mad. Because if Bell... Especially all for, for all the other playoff drivers. I'm not just talking about Bell. A lot of these drivers are not going to... Like, some drivers are going to get cut when they should have been in the championship. Or some... Or Logano's going to win, and then the drivers in the championship don't win it. That's a whole championship. That could be career. Career. Like career that could be like the best thing out of your career and that makes your career your main point of a NASCAR driver is to win at least one championship in the whole season you're trying to make it to the championship that's all you're doing you don't care about anything you don't care about like making it into what well, you do because the playoffs are what makes you into the championship but you don't care if you get eliminated in the playoffs you want to make it to the championship well you do care because you don't make it to the championship but that's what makes me mad don't understand the rules but it is what it is I guess now so, bye.